Hi, this is Tampa Tech, and learn something new from PC, TVs, and gaming too. Let's get it started. Hi, this is Tampa Tech. I'm going to show you how to fix the Samsung Plasma TV made in October 2007. All right, and once you have it plugged in, and by the way, use caution when you uh, work on these TVs, whether it's plugged in or not plugged in, you can still get electrocuted. Hit TV, and then power. So you hear the TV turn on and off, okay? And then hit TV, power, you turn it back on. So, see that blue light? So basically it's telling you like it's turning on. So if you don't get anything on the screen, you know, um, use your Samsung remote and hit TV and then menu. If you don't get your menu on the screen, that's how you know that it's your TV and not your cable box or your DVD player or any of the connections or wiring going to your TV. All right, so if you don't even get the TV menu, then you know something's up, something's bad. Okay, so I have, I have this plugged in and right here when I normally do, my first thing I do, I, I check, is my voltages. So I want to make sure that I got my voltages. Check the fuse, the voltages. This is the bridge rectifier. It changes the AC volts to DC volts. Here's our, um, so basically the power supply powers on the X board and the Y board, okay? So this powers, puts all the DC volts to all the boards powering, energizing all the boards. So you want to check all your voltages coming out of these wires, okay? Next thing you want to do is you know check your fuses going to the boards, like that, and then also, so if you got all your um, your voltages and whatnot, so you check voltages um, when the TV is powered on, but if you can't power on the TV, you might have to unplug this and then try to power on the TV. If the TV powers on while this is unplugged, then it's this board that's the problem. It's preventing the TV from turning on. But with Samsung TVs, it's usually a bulged or swollen capacitor. So, uh, but capacitors can be bad and look good. Just to give you a heads up, you have to read them out of circuit. But usually it's a swollen capacitor on a Samsung Plasma TV or even LCD TV. So you want to check your capacitors. You know, like these, check these, these, and so forth. You will know if you just feel them on top, they'll feel bulged. All right, next over here, so we got no picture on this one. So you check the voltages are right here. And you check the voltages obviously with the TV on, but you check the fuses with the TV unplugged. Remember that. And then right below that, there's another fuse. And that green thing looks like a resistor. It's actually a fuse. So it says fuse right there in that triangle. But that green thing is a fuse. So you want to check that fuse, see if it's good or bad. And if you look on next to it, you see a capacitor that's bulged. So underneath the heat sink, this is the heat sink, underneath that heat sink is a bulge capacitor. And that is the problem with this TV that you get no picture. All right, so you hear it turn on, you hear it turn off, and you got no picture. That is the culprit right there. That's the, that little guy right there is causing your TV not to work. So the location number is right next to the fuse. The fuse location number is F as in Frank 5700. And F stands for fuse. Next to it, it is, I can't even read that. It's C57 something something. But that's the location number for that one. So it's right next to the fuse, the green fuse near the plug. Okay, we're going to go ahead and fix that.